Six bandits are in this camp. And there's, what, six of us as well? Uh, now, unfortunately, people haven't got good skills, right? So Petra can keep up with me. The other one's not so much, especially if this guy's super slow. Uh, are we ready for war, Petra? Maybe I should have got some better armor and stuff first, but we have to make do. They do have a bunch of things. Can I figure out what this does if I take my cloak off quickly? Do I get debuffs or something? I really don't know how this works. Maybe it's not in the game yet. Maybe it's a cosmetic thing for now. Oh, here comes more people. And right at the back. Oh, Mary's hungry. Mary, 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 Mary. Mary. There you go. You went through that quickly. I should keep you going next time. It's time for war. My glorious army, we must defeat our foes in front of us. Engage. Gank him. If they got good weapons, gank them more because they might insta-pop us. It's possible. Oh! Kill that big guy. Kill the guy with the gu- Kill the guy with the big weapon. Good, he's dead, he's dead. Kill them! This is what I was talking about, by the way. As cool as this game is, the positioning is a bit of a thing. So I feel like if they had better positioning for AI, it would look a lot better with the battles. I hope they do some work on that at some point. Exactly the same problem with other games, though. Like, Battle Lord has exactly the same issue with the positioning. I mean, like, uh, mods like Redis the Battle Mod make it look better, but it's not better. They need to actually work on the AI to have good positioning. Anyway, uh, that was awesome. We absolutely smashed that bandit camper with no casualties. So that's very good news for us with our future endeavors. I might have some issues in a second with carrying capacity, but I can just give them stuff and they can just take it back to camp at some point. Okay, what, what did we get? What's our loot? Labour books. And various things. Take those. Ah, oh, loads of food. I'm gonna get some random people fish. Fish. Okay. Uh, was that the only chest capable of me nicking? Is there more stuff we can pick up? Uh, we didn't get any, like, permanent upgrades, like books or... Oh, wait. Straps and simple cords, bandages. That's good to know. Oh, she has a bag, so she can actually carry some things to me. Probably shouldn't give her too much, though. That's stuff I actually need. Let me just give her some bandages so she can carry them with her. Done. Is that what I talked to earlier? Okay, uh, Petra, take all those, take all these, take some extra food as well. Done! So that was a great success. We absolutely smashed it there. I, I'm not seeing any more lootable items. So I think this bandit camp has been cleared. So let's carry on going. So that one was a great success. Let's go up this way. And now we have 615 renowned as well. So that was definitely worth the effort. And we haven't even finished the day yet. We're not we're, we're just about to reach midday, by the way. So what we do, once I hit the second camp, I'll send everyone else home. They can start working again. Uh, I will carry on looking for stuff as we go along here. Follow me, friends. Follow me. Oh, I buy the tower already. That's pretty quick. Learn skill by reading. Archery. I can do archery or I can do hunting. Let's go for archery. So next camp is up ahead. So not that far now. Let me eat some of my... Oh, I go away all my good resources. <laughs> I don't need fancy food such as fish and like cooked meat or actual cooked food. No, no, no. I'll live off mushrooms. Dark wood passage. I think originally when I played this game, this is where the, the brigand's original fort was over here. Okay, so this actually, this camp looked a bit easier, I think, in my opinion. We have to keep an eye out for the guy with the main weapon, though, like last time. Did I loot all the... I think I looted all the bodies. Like I said, it's a bit hard for... Oh, this time, what we're trying to do... I'll see if I can get them to loot for me. Maybe that'd be a better way of doing things, so I haven't got to pick stuff up. Uh, take the fish. Where's Patrick? Patrick? 
have some fish, my friend. Okay. This one should be okay as well. We might get unlucky with the archer, though. If the archer shoots the guy in the face, he's going to have a bad time. There's also a random group of patrol here. We'll wait a few seconds and we'll kill them first. Are we ready? Oh, we're in range. Let's go for it. So what I'll do, I'll have a look at myself at the loop. Gold. Uh oh. Ah, there it is. Oh, there's no loot. Wait, wait. Loot area. That's amazing. Thank you. Who on, soldiers? Oh, that's what I'll just do that in the future. That's way better. Okay, uh. To war! For kingdom and country. Whoa! Okay, I've got a big pull on, man. Some of them spread out, which is good, because they've gone and aggroed the archers now. No! Oh, there's more of it. There was more than I thought there were. We lost someone. Bessie's down. Bessie down. Excellent work, everybody. Start looting the area. Uh, look, no, I need some food. I haven't got any food, have I? I have a mushroom. I can't even give it to him. <laughs> Is, do you reckon you got all the loot, guys? I don't reckon they got the loot at all. Wait, maybe they have. Like I said, until we can get some more quality of life to actually see where loot is on the floor, I just have to presume they did a good job. And it looks like they have done a good job. The loot has been picked up everywhere there. It's going to be hard to figure out what we got from that battle, but we can check when we get back in camp properly. Simple arrows. Loot that as well. Do you reckon we're running out of room? No, that's okay. I'll pick this up as well. Straps, novice books. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We've done it. We've reached our capacity, haven't we? No! Not like this. I'm trying to, I don't want to heal it. Stay still. Stay still. Stay. Hold. Hold here. Okay, farming books, agility book. I need that myself. Nope. Specs. What have you got? Basic stuff. Okay, fair enough. What have you got? Books again. Archery two-handing. I'll take that. I'll take that. So unfortunately, we haven't picked up any, like, super books, or what I was kind of hoping for here. I'm going to randomly assign some upgrades so people start learning a few things. Uh, you do that. And we also get a little bit more room in our inventory. And there's no point in letting that guy farming. Petra needs to, can probably use the bow skills. She's already got plus six anyway, but if she can learn, she can learn, right? I have got more laboring books. Okay. I'm happy with that. Okay, stay there for now. Let me just have a look. See what I can grab here. There's linen, which will save us some resource gathering. Uh, let's... I don't want to drop anything. It's all pretty useful here. I think we got what we need, everybody. There wasn't any weapon drops, which I must admit I'm a bit sad about. But it is what it is. Everybody, you're returning to camp. Good job today. We absolutely smashed some bandits in the face. I'm proud of each and every one of you. I don't feel I need any backup, so Patrick, you can go back as well. So, disband army. Back to work, everyone. Thank you very much. Okay, let's head over this way. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, it's over this way. And we're going hand in the quest nearby town. And at that point, we're going to have over a thousand stuff. So hopefully, if we get lucky, I don't think we will, but no, we're miles away. <laughs> I was say, at some point with the trust, so hopefully we can get enough to actually cap that out and like see what the next stage is. Maybe even liberate the village. I'm look I really want to do that. That's going to be my primary goal for these last few hours of the test. I want to d liberate a village. That is my end goal. Even if I I'm going to just go everything I can towards it. I'll give them all my coins, everything I have. I just want to do that one thing. Okay, let's keep going back over this way. It's funny if there's a bandits now, I won't be able to fight. Mary's leveled up laboring. But how? Oh, is it because they're carrying stuff back to camp with a full inventory? Does that count as laboring? <laughs> I'm still not actually sure what laboring does exactly. If you go and look at one of their things. Building efficiency and production. Productivity debuff. Yeah, I'm not certain. I, I can't say I'm certain about it at all. What about a high level person? Let's look at Petra. What does it like if it's good? Building efficiency is 20%. Maybe it's just random speed and stuff. Anyway, we have reached a village. It wasn't actually that far away. I lost the cord. No, where did the cords go? No, I needed the two cords. Guys, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'll at least sell the coins and stuff, right? I I'm not going to be able to randomly find cords out in the middle of nowhere. I don't know if they still have what I need on them. Because they, they've probably done the bug by now. They probably despawned. Well, not despawned. They've probably teleported all the items back to camp. I can't even look at what they got on them. Nah, it's all gone. It's all gone. Damn it! <laughs> it was going too well. I am my own worst enemy once again. I have defeated myself with stupidity. It's okay. We're expected at this point. Won't talk with. Oh, <clears throat> sorry about that. I didn't mean to scare you, Sally. Are you, new in... you are in no position to make such an. If we if we had protector raking, we can get some professions. Hey, friend, do you happen Where to have control? any weapons to sell? Pitchfork? No, not really. It's sending a lot of meat, though. I wonder if he sells meat specifically because it's Don't winter right now. Stupid. Hello, friend. You do? What is it? 270. Oh, we're getting up there. We're doing it. We're doing it. I think the quest will get harder and harder, by the way. So I imagine that's going to be like, the main way of us doing stuff. Oh, wait. Can, maybe I can buy some coal. I got 1,411 pounds right now. Sorry, not 11. 4, 41. These are tough times we live in. There was no cord here. Damn it. Damn. It's okay. Perhaps I can get some more books and stuff I actually want to learn. Hunting, two-handing, and farming. So, let's see. Hungry and down on I want to get more the books for the core the combat stats. Free, so, so strength and agility. They're quite expensive though, aren't they? Just agility right now. How? Wait, let me have a quick look. Oh, it's miles away. Don't worry about it. It's gonna. I, I might need money later down the line. I just don't understand at this point, so I'd rather not take the risk. Okay, let's go back to the town then. Gods, I hope I. As I won't get enough resources to Those get another person anyway, should we have a look a before I leave? Let me just pick up another guy. This guy is just great. At everything. You look like you could Researching. He can be the main researcher. Secondary, he's very good at farming, so he can eventually be the main farmer. And he's got no, oh, he's a pessimist. Hmm. Let's look for someone else. So, looking around, before I went back, also, I wanted to see if I can perhaps find myself some, um, another companion. Not, sorry, not companion. What am I saying? A worker. A worker this time. There's a guy that I've lost now. He's gone, oh, is that him? He's really good at farming, but he's a pessimist, so he's going to be, he's going to be angry. Are you new in town? No, it's not you. If someone looks very similar to him. So he's got some really powerful stats. He really does. But And I can actually hire him as well. It's not like I'm just reaching here. Though the unfortunate thing was he always Don't has like negative 20 stupid. mood or something. Which was too busy. great. We're surrounded by it's not that guy. He didn't have a profession. Those villagers need to know their place. Ah, is it you? Sorry, I'm busy. Yes, this guy. Look at his stats. He's got a lot of potential here. Not going to be great at combat, but he's going to be great at everything else. So this guy's going to be our main farmer and probably researcher. 
And his secondary is going to probably just be doing regular laboring just to move stuff around. So, Leonard, you are coming with me. Thank you. I'll go back to base right away. Uh, let me just... Oh, actually, I can do this. Better farming. So, priority work. Research. Next up... We're... Oh, Smelting's got its own skill. I didn't realize that. I had to change the skills of Petra at some point, as she does that more often. Okay, so primary skill is research. Secondary skill is farming. And I guess after that, we do delivery. Everything else is going to be a secondary for you, buddy. Are you just staring at me awkwardly? No, he's going back. I think it's because I was talking to him. So that does mean I've got to change things around a little bit then. So Petra, can you do free delivery for cooking? Put... So as we got a dedicated person now, we put delivery on five, and we move smelting to three. So, oh, also I changed as well. Crafting one, smelting two. Then we do hunting three, cooking three. No, cook first. She'd try and stay in camp for hunting. No farming. I think this works out. That's fine. She probably should research if she has to, but I'll put it on a regular thing. It should be fine. Done! Okay, so she's now changed stuff around, and she should be better at with that. It is, of course, nighttime at this point, so it's a bit dark. We want to be heading back to base. Uh, I don't think... Didn't go as well as I thought it would, that little escapade. I mean, we didn't lose any... or we lost one person. She didn't die permanently, she just got knocked out. But I was hoping to find some kind of weapon or drop or armor or something, but... Because I killed, like, what? That was... More than I thought. It was probably like 12 to 16 bandits in total. I'm not sure because there's more in that last bit than I thought there were, but who really knows. I'm going to sleep though just to reset the world. People can start working and hopefully winter will be over. Day 16. I'm going to head back to base because also there's a raid due today as well. So we want to be ready for that when it shows up. Those pop-ups are so quick I don't actually know what they say. <laughs> Could be anything. Oh, that guy's still over here. It's going to take him a long time to get back to camp. Actually, you follow me, because... Oh, actually, that's not going to work. Never mind. It's not going to work if I get to follow me, because he probably refused to. He hasn't got any food. So let's get back to camp, which is actually not that far away. At one point, by the way, I just want to point out, there's actually a building. If I go to Codec, Tech Tree, there's a really, really cool building, which requires actual renown to put down. Allows fast traveling between two or more signs. So this is awesome, right? So I... 150 per put down. I could put one in my village and I can put one in any neutral uh, village I've taken control of as well. So at some point when we liberate the villages, I can teleport between these two places instantly. Which is going to be very, very cool. So this is still winter, right? So winter's dynamic? Because this is why I was confused. So in the video, of course, I kept saying, Winter lasts for three days. We need to be, have enough food for three days. And they're making me look like a complete idiot. The winter lasted for a single day. This is definitely winter still. And it's the second day. At the moment. Maybe. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to say maybe it would change at some point. But we have to find things out. What are you doing, Petra? Mary. Trapper. Oh, she's getting the food and whatnot. That's fine. Cool. I made it back to camp. So, everybody, so what do we want to try and focus on right now? We are still researching the thing, correct? Yes, she just requires some tin ingots, so fair enough. Uh, we're also, someone's doing some hammer, I can hear something in the distance there. I need to try and get myself probably, let's have a look over here. Oh, well, all our food's spoiled. No, is there a, I must be missing something obvious here. Is there a way of making it last longer? <gasps> the smoking! It's short, so I know in real life smoking was very important because it let food last longer. I feel like then maybe we should try and research this. You used to cook more food that than a typical campfire. As well as dry meat and fish with smoking racks. Requires wood to maintain fire and also we get a cauldron as well. This might be what we need. This regular cooking is causing us some issues with long term storage. Maybe that's what we need to figure things out. Okay, uh, what are you doing right now, Petra? Because I noticed that there isn't, unfortunately, a sword for me right now. Unless that's what you're doing right now. What's she making? Requires free crafting. Not enough bronze ingots. 
Oh wait, are there bronze ingots here? Oh, it's crafting right now. Do you reckon we should put down multiple of these? Does this take a very long time to produce anything? Statistics. We've produced a single bronze ingot. Interesting. We'll see how that goes in the long run. And we, if we need to make more, we can just double this up. It's not a problem. Oh, that's what that hammering noise is. He's collecting resources. Oh, she, sorry. How cool is this? Do you reckon this will eventually despawn? Or is it going to be like a... I, I doubt it would be permanent, right? Because that way you just never have to move anywhere. I think it's quite interesting. Maybe it respawns after a set amount of time like other things do. So, bags, bags, bags. We have more bags in the game somewhere. I need to make sure we divvy them out to our people. I've also got a lot of random junk in my inventory, so I should probably get rid of that. Uh, oh, these are actually quite hefty when it comes to storage space. Let me get rid of all these scraps and stuff I picked up as well. Yeah, I think things are going pretty well so far. I'm getting a bit worried about the time, though. But we're going to keep trying to push forward and get as far as we possibly can. Okay, let's have a look. So, where are those bags? i got to make sure everyone has one still. I definitely know they have them at the moment. Bags, bags, bags. Oh, do you know what? I don't know where they are. Hmm. Bronze ingot has been created. <laughs> I will personally deliver it to you. Oh, someone's already picked it up. Oh, he's researching with it. No! I wanted to get the gabbers. That's okay. We can get that for the future, but I did want to get a sword before I head back out, but that's okay. Whatever. Maybe we can get armor and a sword. Guys, where the hell are these damn bags? It does say we have a... Guys, I'm having a bit of a trouble right now. Oh, I've been looking for these bags, but it said she's made four. But the rest are... They've been given to people, so I've just been wasting my time. <laughs> I'm currently now eagerly staring at uh, Leonard right now. Wait, Leonard, why are you researching? As a, that should be a priority, right? Oh, sorry, that is the new guy. I was thinking he was Lobnor. I was a bit confused there for a second. Uh, whoa! Someone's made a blade. Oh, I'm so excited. Wait, 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 where is it? Give it to me. I saw- he took it from the thing. He put it somewhere. Oh, is it- Oh! oh. Makeshift blade, cutting pierce, speed 107. Oh, this is so cool. I have a sword. Oh. Well, I say a sword. It's not really a sword, but it's still. I can... Oh, this is so cool. Makeshift blade. I am so happy I have this weapon. This is like a dream come true, everybody. This is so cool. I like this. Making your own weapons makes this feel so much cooler. So... I reckon we're going to double down on these bloom things. So what we'll do, I'll make like extra ones. We'll have like a forging area around here. So I'll put one there. I'll put another one there. And what we'll do, we'll have like them dedicate to one type of item each. So they're always making like one thing at a time. Uh, so this guy can just be the bronze fella. Get rid of the other two. And we we'll probably want to have more because we have a lot of storage space, right? So I'll make 10 of each. Sorry, 20 of each, sorry. So now we need to get a lot of rocks. Do we have enough rocks in our inventory to actually do this? Storage, crew of stone, 12. We haven't got enough. Oh, Leonard! I don't know where you are. Leonard! Patrick, sorry. Wrong name. We're going. We're going out. Follow me. We need to get ourselves some rocks. So, with the lack of people getting rocks, I feel like we haven't got any nearby, so to go a bit further afield. Might also be worth grabbing some copper again, but we'll have to see. It's definitely harder to see stuff in this environment. Harvest crude stone. Can you just... He's got an axe, isn't he? Not a thing, damn it. Maybe we should have given him a pickaxe. We could have just gone and collect... Oh, there you go. 
In fact, there are spare pickaxes. Should I just go and get some? I can only have... I've got another slot on the back. I think this is for the heavy weapons, by the way. Uh, wait, Patrick! Look! Move, move. Look, Patrick! Move. Do you know what? Thinking about it more, this is going to take too long. We're going to go back to camp. We're going to give him a pickaxe. I'm going to have a pickaxe. We're then going to go and just harvest stones from nearby sources. It should be a lot quicker and probably save us a lot of time. I am still learning skills, by the way. It's taking me some time. I also get some food as well, because uh, I'm pretty hungry. Actually, I'm getting pretty hungry in real life as well. But luckily, I have my Easter egg this morning. I've also got some minstrels that came with the Easter egg, so I can eat that. Do you wonder why I'm having an Easter egg on Saturday? I bought two, because I'm a fat bastard. What else can I say? No. <laughs> that wasn't planned. I want to see, does he dynamically switch between them if he has the ability to do so? Patrick, let's go to the rocks, which is literally just over here. No. Wait, let's see. He might do it. He might do it. Forward, march. No, I had to manually switch them over. It'd be good if they get some better AI for that, so they actually know. Oh. Oh, he's, he's left me. He's left me. Damn it. Do we not have enough food right now? It's because it all spoiled, wasn't it? We had a lot of food available, but... No! No, we have no food anywhere. Oh, God. I should have done better priorities, I think. No, it wasn't my fault. What well, it was my fault. It was because the food ran out. We had food available. It's just gone. Oh, Patrick as well. When we're um, in camp, can your second priority... This is not going to be a permanent one. Can you also help out with the hunting? Guess mine away. Don't matter way. That's not really a mining song, is it? Dicky dicky ho, dicky dicky. No. How did that song go again? <laughs> this is working, but it's not very fast. Oh, there you go. That's a few things picked up there. I'm at least getting some wood and stuff. We have no food in the camp, by the way. I don't know if I put it in the video or not, but my god, we're in a we're in some dire straits right now. There is mass famine beginning. People are just wasting away. It's not looking good for us, but at least I'm finding a source of stone. This is going to take a long time, by the way. I'll probably just skip most of this, because I'm just, just randomly singing songs from a YouTube thing, and also just doing absolutely nothing. Everyone, we're having some dire times. There's no food, no one's fighting or working, and there's a radio on its way. So I've actually run over to this fish merchant to try it's and buy some nice food. Visitors out here in the world. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you! This is going to be an actual lifesaver. So I have one myself right now. Oh, I didn't... This is so bad, guys. This is so bad. So I, I did try and fight by myself. I actually got two of them. There's, like, quite a few. Uh, but the problem is, they started chasing the civilians down. They couldn't even fight back because of the no salmon. I was like, oh, this is terrible. So I decided to quickly run back and try... Are they already there, right? Oh, they're in front of me. They always start trying to fight, but they can't. Oh no, okay, I'll try and jump in, run past them. I've got to dump all the food into a chest somewhere. Once in the chest, it'll take care of itself. I'm coming! I thought I had enough time, but it was too late. Go, 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 go! Because I couldn't even fight back properly with my um, lack of stamina. It was really, really bad. Are they really looting stuff? Where are they? Okay, sneak, 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 not sneak, no sneak, no sneak. I don't care what you want to do to me. I'm putting this in storage. Okay, done. I'll drag them away. Follow me, enemies. Okay, as I'm running away, I've got after that archer when he's shooting. My guy should now go into the thing to get food. Get food, get food! We need food to survive! Even if one person gets food, we can start fighting back. Wait, are they in some popper? Where'd she go? Hey, hey! Run! Dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead.
Damn it. This is what I was saying. I want to try and avoid. Fo Why am I over here? Oh no! Oh no! Follow me. March onward. I it, I guess you respawn your last. No, wait. I set to my bed last night. Did I? I don't know where I slept last time, but all I know is that I'm not where I should be. Petra's down, but she killed someone! Petra took someone down with her. Do they... Do you reckon they carry on looting before they leave? So, so far they've... Is that the last one? Uh, they've taken day five. That was the first one. Oh, damn it! Okay, I guess everything from that is the books, which isn't great. Ah, so the villagers won't go and get stuff. Someone else has killed someone. Because I think they're scared of the enemy. And one of them hasn't got a... Uh, oh, someone's definitely fighting over there. I think we're winning. I think they've done it. Yeah, I think we're... I think we're, I think we're calm. Wait, what's happened over here? I think dying's caused some um, unfortunate situations. Is she auto losing? I think she was. Okay, well, before we lose track of everything, army creates. Pick up. Get all the items, please. He's got some stuff, clearly. Okay, are we good? Okay. What would be cool, by the way? You know when they loot you? would be cool if you can then go back to the base they came from and get your stuff back? Or is that already a feature? I don't know. That'd be pretty cool, though. I like that. Anyway, uh, let's see. Disband army. Bronze ingot has been created, which means we can do nothing. <laughs> yes. Need more cruise stone again. At least people could be able to work a little bit more. She's already going to collect some items. Are we not collecting stone first? How does this work again? I'm pretty sure the higher number of the priorities is right affected what she did first, I think. Interesting. I'm not really certain there. Anyway, let's go to bed and let's hope today is the last day of summer. Summer? Winter. Because uh, it's definitely a problem with the old food and stuff. Let me just end it. Sleep morning. It's over! Oh, how cool was that? Oh, the light. That looks great. I love the lightning effects. Wow, that is so cool. I love that. This is actually really funny because I remember in the demo, if there was ever any lightning in the demo, it crashed it and corrupted the save. <laughs> I hope at this point that's not a thing anymore. Though it would have already crashed by now because as soon as the first lightning went off, it was over. This looks amazing. Do you know what? Even though it cra I'm not surprised it crashed my game. It looks absolutely awesome. Okay, uh, now we're back in times we can collect stuff again, which is good. Leonard hasn't got a weapon though, right? Let's just give him something. If we go to... He needs like a club or something just so he can fight next time. Oh, we can't seem... We don't seem to have any clubs available, which is a bit unfortunate, but I guess it is what it is. We also need more stone and stuff as well. And she's made another blade. Can I give that directly to my friend, please? If you don't mind. Wait, where did I die? I don't know. Uh, I think they might have looted my body. Which is okay, I guess. That's not a problem too much. Ah, perfect. You now have a club. And I can give Leonard a weapon. See? Everyone's happy. Okay, so mushrooms are being good. So let's go, I'm going to go and give them a bit of a hand collecting basic materials so we can reset all the traps. We're then probably going to need to... Is this my drop bag? I think it is. We're then also going to need to try and prioritize a few things. So we know we need... To, uh oh, they haven't looted everything. Damn it. That's unfortunate. 
We may have lost some loot at some point, but whatever. Okay, let's go and get some basic food, though, so everyone can start working. There should be a mushroom patch around here, and if not, we can just go for the berries. And it should be okay. I mean, as long as they eat something, at least we're starting something, right? We're, we're getting in the right direction there. This might take me a bit. We might have to... What I'll do, when we get food production up and running, I'll have to probably remove the emphasis on collecting 20 berries and 20 mushrooms. Mostly because it's going to just be cancelled out, right? Because uh, they don't last very long, and it's like continually gathering it over and over again without really much point if it just despawns in like uh, under a day. Okay, that's 10 of those. Awesome. Let me go back this way. And also, despite the uh, issues of the bandit raid, we have now got ourselves a little bit more renowned as well. So I reckon we probably need like a thousand or so to get the next person. We call there's some kind of indicator of what we need for that kind of thing, but we'll figure out at some point. Oh, they're collecting stuff. Cool. So they're getting rocks from somewhere. Storage! We still got our fish. No, we're not cooking for some reason. What's she doing with all that? What are you doing? Is she using the fish for the baits? She might be. I mean, I don't really care that much, but it would be, it's a bit of a shame using high quality items for that, but it is what it is. So why are we not... Oh, I'll say, because everything stopped, right? So we have... No one was working, so no one was collecting wood. Which means we're not cooking anything. Though no one seems to be coming over here. Let me just try and figure this out quickly. So, settlement population. Cooking tier 3, tier 3. So, Petra's permanently busy. Betsy should cook... Delivering fish, stockpile one to camp. Oh, she's just... Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to just or trying to logically think why she, why she walked off randomly. I can't tell you, but she now has herself the material she needs. So she's probably just collecting some wood, I imagine. Cool. Okay, that's working out. Let's put my stuff in here. I'm going to take two cords as well. So we'll let everyone get back to work a little bit, start getting what they need. I'm going to run off and hand in this quest and see... Oh, actually, no. I'm going to go and do the quest. To talk to the carpenter. We finish that as well, and then we go back and finish both quests in that region. Sorted. So the reason I want to do this as well is because I want to try and find myself as we head out. Where's Patrick? Are you still... Why are you the only hungry worker? I can still make him a person, though. That's fine. Follow me, buddy. I was trying to get him a berry or something. Wherever you might be. Is that you there, Patrick? There he is. Uh, grab a berry, buddy. Move! Move! Patrick! Damn it, man. Okay, he's on it. He's on it. He should be good to go. I'll give you an extra berry just for being good. I thought you abandoned me, but you didn't. Let's get moving. It's pretty cool, actually, because uh, now we both have swords. Well, makeshift blades. So hopefully we'll be a lot better at fighting and stuff as well. So on the way over, I want to try and get some more hemp. Which I think we need for more bags. I... Let's have a look at our storage. Where is hemp? I, don't, I can't even see hemp. Zero. We have absolutely nothing right now. Has the winter reset the hemp? No. We had to find new sources of hemp somewhere else. That's fair enough. We'll find... Oh, wait. Maybe I'm wrong. Move! Move! Go! Actually, they have voice commands. You just say, collect hemp, and he goes and collects hemp. That'd be cool. I like that. Though, of course, probably a bit too advanced. Um, I can't imagine how that would even be put into the game, but they'll probably find a way. Someone will. Oh, there does seem to be some that's respawned, though. Let's give him a hand. Oh, there's lo oh, this is the original place I got loads of hemp from. So this has definitely come back a little bit. Can you drop those seeds? They're going to be just be in the way. More hemp! Forward, march!
Um, he seems to have found more. Wait, can't you get a seed bag in this game as well? Storage, coin pouch, quiver slots. Oh, it probably takes up quick slots. Oh, that's probably for bandages and stuff. You done? Thanks, buddy. It's a good haul. It's a good haul. Definitely enough for some stuff. Need to get ourselves the other items, though, first. Patrick, you're hungry? Damn it. Ah, oh, wait, can we buy a single... Let's just keep us going, shall we? I don't want to lose him. Do you have more cooked fish? Or a need, my friend? It's not often that I... I shouldn't rely on this too much, because it's just a waste of money, really, isn't it? Uh, take that. I have one as well. Done. Okay, cool. So, village is literally just down the road here, so we should be there in a second. Can you grab some random reeds Ooh. while you're here as well? Another blade's been created. So, we're going to have one more after that, and then we should have a full roster of blades. I'm not going to give any amount to random villagers, mostly because it costs resources, uh, until we have, like, a more solid supply. Ten ore, ten ore, fair enough. Okay, we're back. So, who am I talking to over here? Marek Fonley. There he is. How can I help you? Typical. Can't let me have nothing, can he? Well, you did kind of steal his the order. order. I don't want to turn this into a big issue. Thing is, I already started working on the chairs, and I used up a good bit of my stock as a result. And be a better person, then. If you bring me bronze ingots and logs, then I'll give you the letter. What do you say? I don't really have a choice, so that seems fair. Not really. <laughs> you can smelt them from copper mixed with tin ore. I want it. Okay, so we now have even more reason. We should probably grab the logs now. Though I can't do it. Because I haven't got an axe anymore. <laughs> Damn it. We have to use the power of Patrick. To arms, soldiers! Patrick, destroy the logs! Patrick? Yeah, so we use him to cut them down. I can then carry them back to the guy and we can part hand him. The bronze ingots gonna have to wait over time. So we know we need one per blade, right? So it shouldn't no. be too bad. Interesting. This might be too close to the village to collect. Which is might be why he's not working. Wrong okay, fair enough. Because there's a radius, right? So you can't do things too close to the old place here. So we get him to cut down some trees over here instead. At least I think that's what the problem is. If it's not, then I don't know. Patrick, get get up, get over here, mate. I have a secret to tell you, Patrick. It's a secret of cutting down a tree. Move! Damn it, man. Okay. Where's your sword? Patrick. What have you done, Patrick? What have you done to the sword I gave you? Did I give him a sword? <laughs> There's many questions. Okay, I'm going to do it myself. Let me just equip this, and let's cut down some trees. It's taking me a bit longer than I thought it would be. This is a tough tree. What is it made out of? Like, unattainium or something? Okay, one log collected. Next one. I I've got enough room for this, right? Yeah, I should be fine. <gasps> Patrick! <laughs> and that's how Patrick died. I must admit, I'm kind of pissed about the missing blade right now. Does that mean there's already two inside our camp? There's only one. What the hell? I have to watch back in the edit, because I did reload at one point. So maybe I thought I did it, and it didn't actually happen. Could be a possibility. Uh, hopefully it's not a disappearing weapon bug, because that'd be pretty annoying. But like I said, I don't know. Uh, could it just be my fault at this point? Done. I've part given in the items there. We've got to talk to the village elder. Hey, hey, you. 
but we're not going to bother that because he gives us some quests we can't even do. So it's a bit premature for that right now. Okay, let's head back towards the camp. Uh, I think weapon-wise, he's full, right? Yeah, he's completely chock-a-block. Let's try and find... Oh, I know what happened. I told him to try and... I gave him some tools, didn't I? Maybe he gave a tool back. I found like a giant cluster of rocks. I'm going to pick them up on the way back. Because we are still trying to create those two additional ingot makers. So I need to get this sorted out. And then we can do other things at the same time. It does definitely seem like it takes a very long time to create any ingots. So this is probably the best idea, making three sets of uh, fellas. Maybe in the future I can make them all do the same thing. But I think having one dedicated one for each type of item is probably a good idea for now anyway. Patrick's not being very helpful right now because he, he hasn't got any capacity to <laughs> do anything. Oh, cooked meat is being on the menu again. Perfect. So the first one I build, I want to make sure we do tin first because tin is required. Oh, let's be careful. Tin is required initially for the Gabison research. Oh, 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 oh. This way, this way, Patrick. This way, Patrick. There be bandits. Hi. The attack speed is so noticeable already, just having the one basic weapon. Oh, I thought I got that, but I was too late. If only you had a sword, buddy. We're already on 52% raid risk. What have I been doing? It does say your raid increase goes higher when you have more stuff, so I guess it's just because we've got a lot of stuff going on. Okay. That band band camera actually looks quite killable. It really does look quite killable. They got a lot of archers. We give that a shot. But I am seeing guys with swords. It's a level two camp, so that might be a problem. Oh, it's actually pretty handy because we're killing the guys on the way over. We've got to make sure as well. Patrick gets his blade again, maybe. So one of them's an archer. I'm not letting you fight a giant axe guy with a pickaxe. Oh, he did a faint! Did he do a faint? I think he's doing faints. Pick him! Oh, he got hit! No! The HP! You might need this bandage, buddy. I wish I can just bandage you. No, I want to investigate if he heals over time while being on my party. And also, I want to do this bug again. <laughs> Look into my eyes. I am the lord of this realm. Nothing can defeat me. Okay, back in camp we are. Let's quickly get these things sorted out. Oh, I got another one. It's going to take me a while. <laughs> the clicking. We need so much. Done. So one is finished. The oh god, I collected so many stones. I've absolutely smashed this. This is absolutely perfect. So I've actually got enough stones to build. Oh, we got enough for this one as well. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Look at all these little forge areas. How cool is this? So you are going to create only these. And you are going to create only tin. That should be all the things sorted out with their own dedicated forge per item. This is great news, Patrick. And you're also healing yourself, so it does work that way. So I'm going to give you, Patrick, another sword. This time, let's we'll see if you keep it. <laughs> uh, I'm also going to give him the... Oh, I don't want this many, damn it. I, I'm going to give him another wood cutting tool. That's more likely that I'm going to have to use that instead of other things. So, bandage and spit. Bandage and spit. Okay. Let's see. Get rid of that. Use tool. Use sword. And done. Okay. Awesome. So, what do we want to try and do now, everybody? Do we want to try and assist people with just getting resources so we can make more items? That could be a good idea. We also might consider doing... Nothing with this tool, so I can't put it away, apparently. There you go. <laughs> I guess it takes two slots that far. Maybe we help out getting some more food. No, I reckon we should focus on getting tin. So we, we make tin. We can then... 
Oh, no, I need those. I need those too. Give me those back, please. We need tin and bronze, don't we? So I have to wait a little bit of time anyway to get those bronze ingots going. But if we make two tin ourselves, we can then finish off the Gabson research and do something else. So, oh, actually, I can just, because I'm doing it by myself. Tin ore. Tin ore. Sorted. How do I use this? Fuel. Add wood. Oh, okay. I got That makes sense. <laughs> I don't know why I was expecting anything different. That's, of course, that's how that works. I don't think I've got enough fuel, though. Hopefully someone tries to fill this up for me. There's one there. One there. Is that another bronze ingot ready? That's not doing anything, this one. So I will take care of it, probably. Maybe. Another bronze ingot has been created. Though she still needs to make more swords. At least one more, because I've ordered to make two maximum. And if one's already in there, I should have to make another one in a second. So where is this lady I'm looking for? She's miles away. What's she doing all the way over here? I don't know if they even went this far. Yeah, I'd have had a very hard time trying to find her if I didn't realize where she was. <laughs> Hello, milady. I have your stuff. Yes? Just the face I wanted to see. Do you have the materials? Yes, I do. Here they are. Thank you so much. I've wanted to build this for so long. Please take this as a reward. You're welcome. Do you have anything else? Just let me know. She gave me some coins and an old coin. So we can sell that. Oh, is there more missions available now? Because that wasn't there a second ago. Let's go and see if we can maybe get some more quests and stuff on the run. These ones should be in our realm of possibilities because it's like the starting village. So it's probably a good idea to try and do all of them. And also, I also want to redo the liberation thing. So we keep trying to push this damn fence. <laughs> let me through. I've been trapped. Merchant's life isn't easy, but at least I'm not a peasant. Ooh, it's a quiver. So I was tempted to buy it, but I don't think we will. It's fine. We can probably start making those at some point. Okay, merchants. Fair prices. Do you want to earn some good coin? No, I want renown. I can't, but I got some that works for me. That's what I wanted. I need two rugged shirts for my caravanners to provide them with at least basic protection while they're traveling to Farnworth to get some meat. Okay. Farnworth? The village's food storages are low right now, and I was able to get a good deal. Good for you, buddy. Rugged shirt. Is that... Does that require technology, or is that something I can make on default? Uh, codex, tech tree... No, I need to make it. That's cheap, though. Spare Simple cord and strap. Easy. Easy stuff. We probably already have the materials for that already, to be honest. So we can just keep that up after the current research is finished. Going. Well met, fellow. I have a task for you if you want to earn some money. Please go on. One trader gave me an extremely well-priced order. He wants weapons. But due to the tight schedule, I can't manage to get all the iron by myself. That's where you come in. I will give you part of my payment up front if you bring me weapons from this list. No problem. Simple. Oh, that's super easy. Super, super easy. And we got... Oh, I'm so excited. I can get some armor. Okay. Settlement. Population. Let's go and look at... It's going to be in the weave table. It requires feathers. Feathers. It's 32 armor. Wait a second. Oh, that's cool. We are keeping the peace here in the name of Lord Ashbourne. Okay, create two of those. Technology wise, let's quickly smash out that rugged shirt thing. And then after that, we need something else. What was I trying to do before this? It was. Oh, God, I can't think of what it was. The smoke rack. That's what I wanted. Okay, so that should Stop be on its way. Of... Hello, friend. What do you want, buddy? Oh, wait, let me sell these, okay, these first. With all these quests we're getting, we might actually be able to finish the hey, next level. There's been whispers lately. Some weird things are happening at night near Herndine. Okay, what can you tell me about these events? Some of the villagers told me of a mysterious figure lurking on the edge of the village. Some of them even think it's a ghost. Okay. Please ask around and check if this might be some kind of threat to the village. Better safe than sorry. Sure. While your skepticism is noted, you should still be careful. I urge you to consult Theodore and Andrea about what they saw. You can also ask Amelie. 
Even at her most defiant, she tends to know what's going on in the village. I will do this. Okay, this one I'm going to do first because it's actually night time right now, so I can literally just do it. If they only, if I can complete the quest at night, it's perfect. Let's quickly go and talk to everybody to get all the information we need. Oh wait, Where are they? Ain't exactly here. talk to My me. stomach hurts badly. Hi. I'm too hungry. What can I do for you today? Ah, uh, yes. I saw them near the forest at night, like some nocturnal. I'm sure they weren't one of the brigands. Those lazy goons don't patrol the village at that time. A bandit scout or something, I'd say. Hmm, okay. Indeed. I do wish it were that harmless. Best keep your wits about you. There might be more to this than meets the eye. So that guy thinks it's a bandit scout, which is very different than what the other guy was talking about. <laughs> There's ghosts! They're gonna take our souls! No. Oh, please tell me I can do this before it gets too dark. Do I have to talk to all of them? Optional, optional, optional. Okay, that's good. We are that's... keeping the peace here in the name of Lord Ashbourne. Uh, uh, let me talk to you. Is there something you want? Gods, my heart nearly jumped out of my chest when I saw... Th you can laugh at me all you want, but I believe it could really be some kind of ghost. Wait, are you actually a voice actor? Think about it. Whatever it is, it's scaring people at night, and two of us have seen it. She's talking like a human! She's the ghost. <laughs> I, I saw him in the forest near the village. Please, if you go looking for it, or them, be careful. We don't know what it is. Thank you, dear. It's reassuring to know someone's looking into this. Please be careful out there. I promise. Well, that was super quick research, wasn't it? We absolutely smashed that out. Oh. Oh. So, is that, the thing I would like to know, though, is a direction. There's someone in the fields or forest line at night. What direction? What do you need? Gods, why does that old man think I know about everything that's going on in this place? Because you're a spy. Rather no. than just being comfortable with things as they are under our so-called leader. Well, someone ought to take charge. The villagers need... <sighs> so... That's awkward. I The hint's gone, but it, it seems there's a quest marker now, so I'm going to go to the quest marker. <laughs> okay, it's getting quite dark, so I'll take it over there. But uh, for now, let me just quickly go and check for next time. We have already unlocked the rugged shirt, so I'm going to make her make two off as a one-off. Needs hemp. Oh, that's a bit unfortunate. Uh, make two of these, please. Maximum priority. So these do 15 armor, so not that great, but we're going to do it for a quest. It's fine. As for the actual technology, if I have a quick look at the settlements... Where is it? I've lost it. There it is. Go and put down smoking rat campfire. Is this the guy? Don't draw your weapon, pal. I'm not looking for trouble. Okay. What are you doing out here? I am no enemy. I'm trying to hide from the royal bastards, that bandit group. That's all. What kind of group is that? <laughs> they won't find me hiding among villagers close to the brigands. <laughs> Just kill him. No, 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 no. What's your story, good sir? Perhaps are you looking for a job? Thank you for hearing me out. You look like a reasonable kid. I was a part of the Royal Bastards. I joined out of pure desperation. I couldn't get a real job in this shithole of a region. So I joined the Bandits group. But things didn't get any better. They practically treated me like one of you villagers. I have his court money. My first job was holding up a Lord's convoy passing through the lowlands. But the others refused to share the spoils with me, and I was devastated. I wanted to use the gold to get out of this place. And they said no, I left the bastards, and now I'm trying to survive. But they're hunting me. I want to leave this place so much, but I think we can help each other. I have a proposition if you'll hear me out. I already have your money, I already found it. I grew up poor in Farnworth. My mother was working as a maid to the Lord, and my father died when I was three. I thought joining the Royal Bastards would be fitting. Clearly, I'm a moron. Back to the topic at hand. So when I came of age, I decided to leave the Lowlands. But I need gold to do that, so my only way out was a life of crime. And that's my situation. Do you want to hear about my proposition now? Well, I can tell you where the stash is hidden from the convoy raid. I already know. It's 
most likely well defended. I won't do I know. But you look like someone who can handle themselves. It was the first ever bandit camp. We'll share the spoils. I can finally leave this godforsaken land and you'll get a hefty chunk of gold. What do you say? That's what I wanted to hear. Look, I'll mark the place. Yeah, I've done this already. It's already done. So I already have his item. So I can go and get it, bring it back, sort it. But so what I'll do now that we've picked up all these quests, I'm gonna head back to camp. I shall sleep here. We head back to camp, get all the required materials for every single quest, and we we'll come back and just finish off in one big go. The church might take a bit of time to build, so hopefully by the time we get back, it might be okay. Mostly because it said it need hemp, and we haven't really got any hemp production at the moment, so it's a bit unfortunate. Okay, let's get back to camp. So the thing I'm looking forward to also as well is that we hopefully can now produce the or get the technology for that new item, the proper smoking rack. That's gonna be a giant lifesaver, I think. We have currently got a good source of meat and stuff, but it doesn't even last that long, unfortunately. Is that hemp there? No, it can't be hemp. I've never seen hemp around here before. No. Let's duck into the forest itself, try and get ourselves some food so we can run back to camp quicker. Ah, perfect. Oh, berries. I will take that, dump this fella. I probably need that for manure at some point, but at least we have a very large supply. Oh wait, did I, I got a stone? <laughs> I didn't even see that. Mushroom. Farming book. I will use it, why not? <laughs> I am the skill gremlin. I don't even need to use, I probably never will even bother doing farming to be honest. It's not my kind of tea to be honest. I'm more of a fighter. I'm not seeing more... Okay, so I guess the tin's already been used. That's our second ingot I've seen recently. I believe she would have already built two swords. So the ingots in question are just going to be general, general use, right? So how many do we have? For, we got enough. We can go and do that more advanced mission as well. Perfect. So I'll grab that and then we... Oh, we can do all of them at the same time. This is absolutely perfect. We're going to get a lot of renown from this. It's going to be glorious. And maybe enough thing to actually get um, Hadeen into a place where we can actually try and liberate it. Because I, I really want to find that. That'd be so, so cool. Anyway, back over this way. So, her, is she making the rugged shirts? We definitely need those. She's making something. Or oh, No, that's Patrick. Patrick, what are you doing? Why are you doing this? Well, as long as someone's doing it, I guess it's fine, right? <laughs> someone's making something, that's all I know. Uh, let's see, so before I forget... Expand loop, got it for the next time. I've also got some random hemp in my inventory. Let's get rid of those. So, that's one item picked up. We also need to get ourselves the... where is it? The ingots. Done as well. What else do we need to get? Let's have a look. J. So, simple axes times five. We have that available. That shouldn't be a problem. Oh no, we're missing one. Is it somewhere else? There it is. So that's that done. Rugged shirts being created. Staghorns, bronze ingot. Okay, so what I'll probably do now, I'm going to go and head over to the quest thing. Hide log rope. I'm actually also going to drop off two rope. Do we have any logs I can give them as well? Because I could probably part hand in. Just for the future here. Do we have logs? Cool. We can do quite a few things, actually. I Patrick should probably come with me. Patrick. There may be some enemies on the road we can take down the way over. So, Patrick, join me, buddy. Now, you haven't got your weapon, have you? Which is extremely annoying. Oi! Is that a sword? Maybe he... Oh, I think he handed his tool back in. So now he hasn't got a tool. Well, that's okay, I guess. That's, that's fine. Let's go! <laughs> Let's get out of here. Oh, that makes... It's weird, though. It didn't do that last time. That's a bit strange. Oh, whatever. It's, it's, I'm sure it's fine. So, back over this way. Let's hope we get lucky on the way over. You already have stuff, right, buddy? You have... Where is he? K... Oh, sorry. K... Oh. He's got tons of wood on him. That's a bit of a pain. 
do you actually have wood on you? Wait. Get, no, don't fall. Just come over here. Just come over here. No, he's clean. It's fine. He must have dropped it when he became my companion, so it's not a problem. So, 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 so. We need to get ourselves some more hemp and stuff so we can carry on producing items. We definitely used quite a bit earlier, so we may not even have enough to get all the rugged things sorted out. Raid increased 90%, so maybe we're going to get raids every day at this point if we become too strong. I would say that'd be annoying, but I actually kind of like it, because we get free money, free straps, maybe it's on purpose, and also we're going to get ourselves some other things as well, such as like potentially book drops and that kind of thing, and experience everyone fighting. It's basically a pretty good thing. If they take damage and don't die, it doesn't matter. If they die, they respawn. It's not a big deal. Okay, fast has us over there. Let's actually mark quests so I can see where I'm going to be going here. Not that one. This one. 300 renown. That's quite a chunk. At this point, I'm not going to take anyone else from this village. Uh, sorry, the other village. I'm going to try and save up for like some proper people. Maybe like some blacksmith, carpenters, that kind of thing. Actually, I say this village. I'm not going to take low level guys. We're trying to get professions at this point. Or Oscar. If we get this village and start liking me, I can get Oscar. Awesome. Oscar's the guy with the sword skill, by the way. He's definitely going to be a warrior at some point. So, I'm giving this item to you. Greetings. Did you bring everything that I asked for? Yes. Well, deal's a deal. Here's the letter we with are the keeping order. the peace here. I hope that old timer Dalibor Ashbrook. doesn't forget to actually make them this time. I think this memory is fine. His last job should have been retired years ago. Look, it might seem like he's doing just fine, but he's stubborn as a mule and twice as mad. He'll never admit nothing. Okay. He can barely oh. hold tools anymore, and a full day's work nearly kills him. He should probably Delibor resign. won't be able to fulfill that order for Lord Ashbourne. And when Ashbourne finds out, he'll kill Dalibor. It's a bit of stream, isn't it? That's why Dalibor's apprentice came to me. He was scared for his life. Interesting. Fair enough, it's not my job to convince you. You can go now. Some intrigue behind this. Keep going. So that's that Those first quest sorted out. Oh, I can it keeps going. Those sort of the guy. Be more grateful. What do you want? Make it quick. Ha. Huh. Old Dalibor found another apprentice to run into the ground, huh? I suppose I can help you, but remember, nothing comes for free in the lowlands. Ah. Uh. You want the tools? Then help me with the wolves. They've been that's attacking fine. people that. who are simply trying to travel between villages. That's that's, a, that's my kind of quest. If you can kill some of them and bring me a pelt as proof, I will prepare the tools for Dalibor in the meantime. Anything you can spare, kind. Bring soul? eight pelts. Oh, it's just a general bring me stuff thing. Do I have eight pelts at my base? We have zero pelts. I was expecting that. <laughs> okay, so at least we have a general gist of things we've got to do here. Uh, what was the other quest I've got to bring in in this part of the map? So this guy got a part hand in. Those peasants should be more looking for trouble. So that's the oh, town leader. I would give for leftovers from the Hello, Lord's Trevor. feast. You heard correctly, my child. The royal bastards, to be precise. Oh, is this a new quest? To harass us a couple of days ago. Oh wait. Oh, okay. Well, I got to do this anyway. Let me just talk to the guy. They should be easy to find. The brigands' laziness made them so cocky that the bastards made their camp next to the village. Okay. Is that the one that's down the road? I hope you are not going by yourself. I have like an entire village at this point. A sensible approach, young one. If you're walking into the wolf's den, keep your eyes open and have all the necessary weapons and armor for you and your comrades if you decide to take them with you. And one more thing. The bandits like to hoard many materials they don't use. So search their camp thoroughly. No worries. Good luck, young one. The royal bat. Okay, actually, that wasn't why I was here. It's because you're me. Yes. All right. Wait. What? 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 How many quests do I have with this guy? I have like three different quests. Okay, that one's sorted out. You haven't left me yet, right? Okay, let's quickly. What can we buy from the merchant, which I can now talk to? And I will pray for you. I'm being robbed here, but I don't want him to leave. Take the mushroom. 
Stay with me. Beware the bandits on the roads, my friend. Oh, just the person I was hoping to see. You've got a knack for building, right? Not Our ready. is in a bind. We're seeing fewer travelers than we used to, and it's hurting business. I have an idea that could help, but I need someone with your skills. Okay, what do you need? <laughs> yes. Well, I can't do much about the bandits and the brigands and wild animals, can I? But I'm a fine sign maker. And make signs is exactly what I intend to Commission do. me to kill the bandits. Actually, I already have been commissioned. Work peasants, there's no time first. to lose. You'll need materials. There's a copse of trees near Herndeen that's perfect. Good luck. Build travel sign. Is that here? We, oh, I haven't researched it yet. Sorry. So that's the one that actually requires me to use Renown to build it and stuff. So for now, though, let's head back to the old camp, shall we? We haven't got any... Uh, I might have to go and kill some wolves. Because uh, we haven't got any pelts at all, have we? We'll have a quick look around. Though, really, we should just be using the hunting materials. I'm not sure why the hunting is not working at the moment. But it is what it is. I might actually send... Oh, that camp looks awesome. I might... Oh, wait. This way. There is something in the wilderness. If this is wolves, it's actually going to be pretty handy. I'd rather it be bandits, though. We'll have to see in a second. Oh, there's like a whole slew of... Oh! Oh, this is, this is literally the both of best... Both... Oh, there's so many. Okay. Kill the bandit, kill the bandit, kill the bandit. Get the XP, XP. Yes, got it. Wow, is this enough pelts? Okay, wolf fangs. Excellent. We need these to. We can sell them for like five or so renowned at a base, which is actually pretty handy. Oh my god, did I get what I needed? Maybe we should just walk around a bit and see if we what we can find. There's more over there. So I had to use this anyway to go back, right? So pelts track. Wow! There's so many! I love big scale stuff. Look at this! this I'm going to kill them all! There, oh my god, there's so many. There's so many. Okay, we've got five, six. I should have some more food, I think. Wait, no, no. Whoa. Okay, they're coming, they're coming. Imagine we in my uh, armor right now. We can probably see a difference of defense here. Should I just keep going? I mean, once I find some someone to fight, I don't really want to go somewhere else. Okay, I was trying to do a thrust in time when it came over to me. Patrick's hungry. We got food, buddy. We're getting food. Don't worry. We're doing everything here. Oh, we got so much. So that quest is done. We've done that quest. It's not a problem here. Have I run out of stuff? Okay, can you pick up the rest? We had to leave, Patrick. We can't kill her anymore. Okay, we've gone way. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. We have loads of food. Look at all this. This is perfect. How are we doing, by the way? I just want to quickly double check as well. How are we doing with that technology? Why have we not done it yet? Do we not have what we need? Wooden hemp. It's probably going to be the hemp. Oh, be careful, be careful. Stay away. This way. The more I play this game, the more sad I get. Because I want to carry on playing it. But we're going to run out of time, guys. It's going to be so sad. I've still got five hours left, by the way, at the moment. But it's uh, it's getting a bit like, oh, no, it's going to be over. Welcome. Why is it going to be over? <laughs> Why? <laughs> you give and then you take. Why would you do this to me? No. Level one raid. I think that's what that means, right? Because last time I had a two on it. Well, the guards can take care of it. I don't have too much time. So if you need something, make it quick. Uh, pelts. Did you take care of wolves? Excellent. I am a man of my word. Take those tools, and we will consider ourselves even. 
cool. There seems to be another person I can talk to now. I have been given a lot of stuff. This is a bit mad. Come yeah. closer. God's above, it's the fields. The damn bandits blocked the way, and now I'm up to my neck in it. Can't access the wheat. No. Haven't got the gumption to square off against them. I do. Not with the scary yarns that folks I've been spinning. Fields are there for the taking, but here I am, not able to do nothing about it. Um. Oh, you'd do that for me? I'd be very grateful, but watch your back. These bandits are no laughing matter. You fancy a fight? I always fancy a fight. Okay, let's get back to base then. So we have a slew of quests right now. Level 2. Fine wheat field. Okay. Size prospect, build travel sign, bring X bandit loot. Oh, guys, we're going to get so much renowned. I'm so excited. We're going to be the renowner. The renownman. Where's that main quest that they gave me? Where is this? It is that bandit camp. I reckon we can kill that, by the way, with what we currently have. We're not going to do it for now, though. When we get to Winter, we'll do like a giant group attack on it again. But for now, I think it's fine. So let's go and mark this one first, because I've got to remind myself if I forget if I'm just running around around. Wait, Patrick! He's gone. He's Patrick's gone. <laughs> He's gone back somewhere. Don't worry about it. I mean, he, we were living off mushrooms, so I'm not too surprised. He, What did he have on him? Did he have... He had hemp, right? So he would have teleported that back immediately to the base. So they, in theory, now have hemp to finish off the research, which would be pretty handy. As for me, though, let's go back. This meat's really run out by the time I even get back. Oh my god. That's not Patrick, is it? That's some, that's some other guy. No idea who that is. Oh, it'd be Lubnor. Small trap. Okay, I made it back. Let's see. I need to... Get rid of all this food first. People start processing it. I need to grab the shirts. And then we can go and hand in like a crazy amount of quest. Oh, the food's gone again. No, There's no wood here. Oh, god damn it, people. Do we just have no wood? We should have a full-time woodcutter. I'm confused on why he's not doing it. Let me just check the priorities. Maybe I made a mistake. Okay, uh, inventory, settlements, building. Okay, so he should just be doing that first. Why is he not doing it? I reckon I know why. I'm going to go out and say it's because I stole all the axes and there's no available. No, they're doing it. Are they? Hmm... If they're doing it, they're not doing it very well. No, she's doing something else. Weird. Have they cut down all the wood in this radius? Is that what's happening right now? It says we have two workers doing something. No, he's going, he's walking around with an axe. He's going to go and pick up some wood strange anyway uh let's move on shall we so what are we doing now we need to probably try and get some wood anyway just so we can start cooking all that food so i'm gonna give them a quick hand of that once that's done we need to go and hand all these quests so i need to still pick up those two shirts from somewhere and then we'll head back towards the main village where is the damn wood <laughs> i only need like a little bit there you go i'll, I'll put in four and at least then it should last for a little bit of time Hopefully, after I get back, we would have finished that other research so we can get a cooking cauldron. Get rid of that original fire and have a bit more of a professional cooking station kind of thing. So just having a random pile of junk, just very slow to cooking things. Okay, so I'm going to dump this over here. And then it will begin once anew. 
done. Maybe we should increase the amount of wood we're actually collecting. Because we have put it on 50, right? But we need wood for everything. And also all the fuel as well. Let's do that. Okay. Now, where are the shirts? Should be around here somewhere. Shirts. I need your... Rugged shirt. Let's pick up some more books while I'm walking around as well. Let's do some hunting books. Because I think we're getting quite close to me potentially unlocking hunting and bows and stuff. So it would be pretty handy to be good at it. Oh, wait. Before I leave, there's food to get. No, there's not. She has it on. Let me have the... I'm so hungry right now. Done. Okay, that should keep me going to get over to the objective. So before I go too far, let's double check. Smoke meat can't do that yet. That's another quest anyway. Uh, okay, letter and tools. Good. Done. Rugged shirts. Collected. Simple axes. Inventory. That's everything, right? Expand loot in inventory. We should be good to do go and do five quests or four or five quests. This is going to be so cool because I, I hope it's going to push us above the threshold to maybe get to protect the status of the village. Does that mean I can then attack it and liberate it? I have no idea, but if it does, oh my god, I'm going to be excited for that. It's going to be absolutely awesome. Okay, let's go. What we'll probably do, we'll go and run over to the other side of the village first. we hand in the quest to that random lumberjack guy. Then maybe we can recruit him as well. We need more dedicated people for various jobs. Uh, I'm going to say probably more hunters because we don't seem to be doing it very fast. Hunt, well, basically, Hunter's Gatherer is everything. We need loads of those. We'll look at his skills, though, first. Why, hello, good sir. I have brought you your ex loot. Did you find the treasure? Gods, finally, take your half. I can leave this place after all these years. Don't worry about the villagers. They will never see me again. Farewell. I didn't really want to recruit him anyway, to be honest, so I'm happy that ended that way. So that quest is done. Yeah, anyone that decide, even if they're in a bad situation that turns to crime, there's always an, there's always a choice. I don't think that's a choice anyone should be taking. Of course, I know there's some really awful situations out there, but I would never consider that. I'd rather die than hurt someone else, um, at least innocent people. I mean, if there's a guy trying to rob me, I'm going to kick him in the face, but that's another matter entirely. <laughs> <laughs> Which I've done before, by the way. Learn karate or something. And uh, self-defense is very important. That's why I always say. Anyway, moving on. Uh, let's see. Where is the Majant? Rusty in sight. Have you got those rugged shirts? I want to send my caravan as soon as possible. Here you are. Wonderful. I hope my men will not have to test their durability. Strength novice. Big old chunky chunks. Chunkicus. Let's talk. Hail fellow. Yes? Was he a bandit scout or a ghost like Andrea theorized? A former bandit. Don't worry, he won't be bothering us anymore. So what did you decide to do with him? I let him go. He just wanted to leave the lowlands. He assured me he would no longer bother the villagers. I'm glad that you were able to resolve this without bloodshed. But I'm not sure if he will keep his word. If he doesn't, I will kill him. He had his I choice. I suppose we'll see if this decision was a good one. Take this as a reward. Uh, one-handing. Oh. Uh, cooking? No, laborer. 200. Oh, it's flying! Flying, everybody! Track quests. Oh, wait, let's have a look. 670. Oh, I don't know if we've done it, but we got more quests popping up as we're doing this one, so. Yes, is there something? So, do you have those weapons? Finally, start working on this order. Uh, two handing. Is there a double check? What else is there? This one. I don't think we've made it. But we have lots of new quests are appearing, so we can go and do those as well. Maybe after this array of quests, we should be good to go. I we're doing it. I've got we got time. We can liberate this village. It's happening. Bring everything that I asked for. Indeed, my young pal, that's everything. Th Finally, I can work on this and retire. Nothing but venison dinners and evenings swigging mead once I'm done. 
It's good. It's good. I hope it goes well for you, Take my friend. This coin for a job well done. Crafting. Agility. Why would I mention that to him? I'm just going to say happy. He said he's going to retire, right? So he retires. Simple. Hmm. I see. I didn't believe. Is this a story request that hasn't gone on yet? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what will happen there. So we are on a staggering. That hasn't gone up at all, has it? 1,272. If the village hasn't got to a point where we get more people yet, we might want to recruit some other pe people. Me badly. At this point, though, who would be wanting to join me? Yes. Unfortunately. In Interesting. Well, let's go and see what other quests are available anyway. We're going to talk to some random people. I have a lot of quest books now. We'll try and get those being pushed through as we play the game. Let's get rid of that. Don't need that. Oh, I have got some coins. Oops. Let me just sell those quickly. Sir, I have some coins for you. Hello, friend. You do? What is it? 170. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yes. If you're so eager to do things for the village, I have one thing in mind. Our village hall, the heart of our community, lacks the luster it once had. I would like to Favorite decorate it for an old soul. If you're as skilled as they say, you can contribute by crafting trophies for the hall. Oh, he wants a stag head. Prove your worth, impress me, and perhaps the reward will be yours. Confidence is a start, but let's see if you're craft. Ah, oh, there's... Oh, God. Yeah, so this is an advanced quest. We can't do that one, but fair enough. Uh, that's going to take a while to... F so uh, it's looking more like we're going to probably have to go and get ourselves a another person for now. deliver the books that I have ordered. But he should have been here a few days ago. Something disastrous must have happened. I should check the roads. Perhaps his cart is broken or he's spending too much time in taverns again. Uh, did you pay him up front for delivery? But I know him well. He's always been trustworthy. I'm sure that something is wrong. Can you please help me? Oh, thank you. Please check along. Oh, that's not a good sign. That's where the <laughs> it didn't go well. It did not go well. Uh, one more quest giver we can find over here. We go to sleep after that, and I'll look Spare in the morning a for a new person. There's no time to lose. You. Well met, fellow. Aye. There is one thing, mate. I'm working on a caravan with Marek Tholi, a lad from Padstow, to improve the trade routes between our two villages. Okay. That's what I like to hear. Here's what you need to do. Get me three rugged shirts. <sighs> and then you need to check on Merrick Tholi in Padstow. He promised to deliver some caravan parts, but there's been some delays and I haven't heard from him. Well, that's annoying, isn't it? Because we... <laughs> We have to make more. It's actually, I say it's annoying. It's not really, is it? We just make more. Uh, let's. Everyone's going to go to bed, so I may not be able to find people. I'm going to quickly sleep, and we'll go from there. Let me just run over here. I, I, we're going to have 10 minutes? Yeah, that's fine. Um, I will remotely set that up, though, so I don't forget about it. So, weave a table. Make my... Make me... Free rugged shirts, please. Where do we get feathers from? Maybe it's a hunting thing where you shoot out the birds from the sky to get the feathers. I, I, if not, I can just shoot the birds out the sky. It's not a big problem. Also, especially if they're not moving. <laughs> if they're not moving, it makes things very easy there. Day 19. Wasn't there a raid due today? Four days until winter. No, I think it's a level 1 raid, so I'm not actually going to be worried about that. Okay, so before we head back to the old uh, village then, let me try and scout out another person. So I want to try and get someone that is like another dedicated woodcutter person. So we want someone with good woodcutting skills. Now, just to confirm how that works, it's been a bit of time. Woodcutting to... What skill was that? I presume it's harvesting we need. So we need another good harvester. 
So I'm going to ask everybody I see, though of course a lot of them we can't deal with because of course they're needing protectors. So anyone that hasn't got a job or looks generic? Nope. We are trying to talk to. And we want to have some people with good skills, because if they've got bad skills there's literally no point to it. Uh, let's see, there's a random guy. Okay, we can hire that guy over there and probably her as well. Are you new in town? It's customary that you should greet the elder. Seven strength. Seven. Oh, she's amazing. Oh, we're hiring her. They're not even gonna. Yeah, you're, you're with me. She's great. Seven strength. Sorry, I'm still processing. <laughs> seven, seven strength though. Should we? Switch over Patrick. Cause she has a better potential. No, no, I want to. No, no, sorry. No, I'll leave. Eventually, Patrick and Brigitte will be in the camp full time. I, I'm gonna bring with me warriors with traits for my main companions. Uh, so you go back to camp, please. We need to get another housing as well. So your skills are very vast. You have a lot of potential. Five, five, five. So her priority should probably be. Maximum cooking. Wood cutting two. Harvesting three. Delivery four. Don't care about the rest of it. Does that seem good? I think that should work out pretty well. Cooking. Yeah, that's your that's your job, my friends. Good luck with that. Off you go. So that is pretty awesome. We've got some more people here. I'm going to go back to base anyway. We're already making some rugged shirts, which is great news for us, because we need as many as possible. Uh, let's see. Caravan part. I, I guess we have to go and talk to that other guy first anyway, because we need to figure out what's wrong. So i got to do that at some point in the future. Whatever quests do we have that I might be able to do? Trophy team be a long one. Wheat field, optional. Kill things. That one's possible. The other ones we can't really do right now. So let me put this as my next... Thing. So we have to identify where this wheat field is, which is over there. Oh, it's, I've never been over there before. Looking forward to it. Let's see what's over there. I might have gone on a bit of an expedition, though, because uh, we have not found hemp <laughs> anywhere. I think people were just permanently stuck in a loop of uh, gathering mushrooms and everything there, and they keep spoiling immediately. Basically, it's not a great situation. I'm. How do we want to do this? Maybe I should change things around a bit. So the reason I wanted to prioritize food is so people actually work, right? But I think I've put too much food in the priority. And also, every if I collect 10 mushrooms, they go off within, within a day. But also, they once they're cooked, it removes it from the inventory, so they go and get more mushrooms again. So I think what we might do, if I run back over here quickly, I might change priorities again. So berries are probably more numerous. So we'll put this down to priority 1 to 10. This is 10 as well. This is still maximum priority, but I want less of them. So hopefully they would be a bit faster collecting stuff. Next up, I want to have... Let's think about this for a second. Priority 1, priority 1, 4. So next is flax. So they get flax. They get wood. They get river reeds. And I'm also going to say hemp. As we need a lot of these, I'm going to increase this to 50. And hopefully we can start gathering stuff. Now, I will point out as well, this thing is a bit of a problem because it has, like, only one working slot. So it might be an idea to make a second foraging hut somewhere else. Though right now everyone's doing a lot of jobs. I'm surprised we're solving trouble with this, to be honest. But what are they doing? Delivering wood, working. I think I just need more de dedicated people. And hopefully it will help push things through as we play the game. So, what do I do now? Let's go back over this way. I do have some pelts I can drop in. Well, everybody, that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope that everyone has enjoyed. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I'll see you next time. Bye.